From pressure elections to the game of the week, we've, we've got, got the scoop. scoop. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Saturians. Today is September 7th, 2016. And yes, I know my voice is scratchy, but it's because I'm kind of getting sick. So bear with me, you know? Uh, yeah, Marco, just make sure you, you keep a safe distance away from me. And, you know, here's a tissue, you know? Just take one. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Anyways, let's get started with some, new, uh, some news that happened today in U.S. history. American Revolution in 1781. Blood battles begins at Ed Edward Springs, South yeah. Carolina. After receiving reinforcements on this day in, in 1781, Major Gen General Nathaniel Green of Continental Army resumes offensive action against Lieutenant Colonel Alexander Stewart and British so soldiers at Utah Springs located on the banks of the Santee River in South Carolina. The Patriots approached early in the morning, forcing the British soldiers to abandon their uneaten breakfast in order to fight. Don't worry, we didn't forget tho about those who were born on this day as well. So if today's your birthday, well, Happy birthday. birthday! You share your birthday with Big Boy DJ of Los Angeles' Urban Station 92.3, hosted the morning from 5 to 10 a.m., which was syndicated to numerous stations across the U.S. before fame. He became his musical career DJing high school parties, and, and his nickname Big Boy came from his round, plump physique, but underwent, he went under a huge weight loss transformation during the 2000s, and he lost like about 250 pounds. Not only but only him, but rapper um, Wiz Khalifa. He became he became known for his hit song "Back in Yellow," which hit number one on the Billboard Hot 100, and he won a Billboard Music Award for Top New Artist in 2012. He won a BET Award for the Best New Artist in 2011, and his song "Young, Wild, and Free" was nominated for a Grammy Award in 2013. Well, hey, let's get started with some school news here, shall we? Yeah. School supplies are being s uh, supplies for sale. Have your teachers for have your teachers ask you for binders, competition books, calculators, flash drives, pens, highlighters, three-hole punch mark, three-hole punch marker sets, and other school supplies. If you answered yes, then the science club can help you. They're selling school supplies in room 403 for 25 cents and up to two dollars. Want to find out more about college requirements? Want to hear what college is like from actual college students? Interested in a career science or technology, engineering, or math? Looking for a place to eat lunch indoors and out of the heat from all those fakes, you know? You know, you know how it is. Come see what Science Club is all about. Thursday in lunch, it, Thursday in lunch, room 403. Engineering students from UCI are ready to meet you. And most importantly, permission slips for our first field trip are due this week. So. The Marine Studies Center is asking for an accurate head count for the canoes and for the lunch. So remember that spots are limited and to get your permission slip in. Band is looking for Color Guard members. They have a coach but need more of you fellow centurions to join. The coach is well experienced, so it's an opportunity you guys should take. For any follow-up questions, please see the band director right near the ASB window. Since you mentioned ASB, Marco, which I know you are in freshman, Listen up, freshmen. Elections are coming to ASB, and it's not too late to turn in your packet. And more on that, here is with us in the studio are two fellow ASB members. Um, hello, I'm coming freshman. Uh, if any of you are interested from, to join ASB, you're welcome to come to the ASB room and 
come and get the packets by the strap. Uh, some requirements to the to for the packet is that you must have sig 60 signatures for it. You also must not have any Fs. Also, you must have a free fourth period, and you have to write an essay for the packet when you turn it in. So some of the freshman program positions are president, vice president, secretary, and treasurer. And some of the stuff we do is like have work days, and we set up the assemblies, and we do the blood drive, as well as teacher appreciation week, and back to school night setup, and open house setup, and international week. So freshmen, don't forget to pick up your packets and make sure to sign up for ASB. Mr. Parra met the parents of Luis Antonio Torres and they informed him that there has been a slight change in plans. They will have a, a burial service and this changes the time for the vigil. Vigil service on Friday, September 9th from 4 p.m. to 9 p.m. at Brown Canolio Mercury, 204 West 17th Street between Main and Broadway. Burial service on Saturday, September 10th at 10 a.m. at Santa, Santa Ana Senate Cemetery, 1919 East uh, Santa Clara Avenue. The race team meets today, right after school in room 333, so make sure to stop by. And now moving on to sports. Cross Country will be having their first meet today at 3.15, and more on that. Um, we'll, if you have more questions about this, you could talk to Coach Shepe later, if you see him. But, yeah. I'm here with Coach Shepe from the Cross Country team. So today is your first meet. Tell me about it. Uh, today we have a Sanana City meet. That's basically all the Sanana high schools. We go against Godinez, Sanana, Sikerstrom, Saddleback, um, and Century. It will be a tough one for, t for us today. Uh, everybody is uh, expecting a good turnout. We have a lot of uh, new runners this year, so I'm excited to see what happens at the end of the meet. Do you have any returners you're looking forward to, to lead the team? Uh, I have a couple of uh, boys. We have Sergio Rodriguez and Angel Beltran, uh, seniors. They're, they have been in the program for the past three years. This is their four years, so I'm looking forward um, to see what they're capable of doing at the beginning of uh, our season. Um, our class of girls, which uh, were our famous uh, five, five from uh, last year, varsity uh, runners. They're also back this year, so I'm kind of excited to see what, what happens today on that team. Thank you for this interview. Good luck at the first meet. Uh, thank you, and I uh, hope to uh, see some people who are cheering for us at Godinez today in Tango Park. Back to you at the studio. Our varsity girls tennis team will be going. Will be traveling to the home of the Godinez Grizzlies today at three o'clock. So if you see any girl tennis team players, wish them luck. Varsity football will be playing this Friday, and we'll go up against St. Francis Catholic High School at seven p.m. And last, our defending Orange League champion, varsity girls volleyball, will be having a game today. Yeah. Having a game today at. Um, 4 p 4 p.m. against Rancho Alamitos. Rancho Alamitos. Yeah. It's game of the week, so better see you guys there. Good luck to our ladies and good luck to our ladies. And in the studio today with us is one of our one of the varsity girls captains, uh, Billy, also known as Evelyn. Hello, guys. Actually, and I'm here with Billy, who is the varsity girls volleyball team um, captain. Um, so you guys are going up against Rancho Alamitos today. Tell me about how you're feeling about this game. Um, I'm very excited for the game. We got a good head start. 2-0, and today we play home. That would be very good if you guys came in support. You guys should definitely come and support the girls' volleyball. Okay, now back to the anchors. Bye, guys. Hey, by chance, do you know what time it is, Marcos? Um, yeah, of course I know what time is it. You know, the favorite part of my bro uh, the broadcast. Oh, well, you meant Snapchat us. Well, I was talking about, you know, the current time at the moment, but, you know, Snapchat us is, is good, too, you know. Well, I guess that's out of the way. It's time to Snapchat us. us. When the 
rest of me is down me, even when you're not around. I will try to knock them down. I'm watching all day. Now I know what I have found. My heart up when the rest of me is down. You, you enchant me even when you're not alone. I wanna lock in your love I think we're close enough Could I lock in your love, baby? I feel we're close enough I wanna lock in your love I think we're close enough Could I lock in your love, baby? Could I lock in your love, baby? Remember to to be featured on this daily segment, send in your pics of you and your squad to our Snapchat, InsideScoop.tv. Well, everything must come to an end, Centurions. But always remember, your vision, your vision is, is our future. future. Bye. Bye.